Hey guys, what's going on? First off, I want to thank you guys so much for getting us to 4,000 subscribers. As we speak, we're a little over 4,100. Remember, the next sticker giveaway is going to be for a full-sized 3x24 Curse Forever banner at 5,000 subscribers. So on to the Honda. I've uh, been having a couple issues with it, uh, you know, track days and whatnot. For one, it's not light enough. The wing is helping a lot with the downforce in the corners and shit. Should have seen this fucking Ferrari 458, dude. He was so jealous. But So we're going to lighten it a little bit today. And uh, we're also going to take care of the fuel economy. We're going to do that first real quick. So uh, I'm going to show you this cool little trick that will boost your fuel economy real quick. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Thanks for tuning in. Alright, so the first thing you're going to want to do to increase your fuel economy is get the appropriate size drill bit and drill some holes wherever you want. It, it doesn't matter where you, on the car you put them because you can put this anywhere and get the uh, the same result. But uh, this will give you a huge boost in fuel economy and uh, it seems kind of crazy I know to be drilling holes but it will work. So all right, step one is done. All right, guys, so everybody knows turbo diesel cars get better fuel economy, right? So all you're gonna need to do is go to a junkyard and go to any mid 80s turbo diesel Mercedes and just take one of these badges off, okay? You just take that off, you pop it into your holes that you've drilled, and uh, just like that, you're going to be getting a uh, far better fuel economy because your car is now turbo diesel. All right, so a lot of uh, a lot of things that have to do with weight reduction in cars start with carbon fiber parts, and I know the hood is like the most popular one to do. Have you guys seen the price of fucking carbon fiber hoods? It's ridiculous. So we're going to apply this roll of carbon fiber vinyl to the hood and that should give us roughly the same effect I believe and uh, none of us have ever wrapped anything before so this should be interesting alright so first we gotta actually make sure there's enough vinyl here to do the hood if not I guess uh, we'll do most of the hood <laughs> but that looks like it should just be enough Considering you can stretch it and whatnot, I think well enough. Except uh, right here, but uh, well, I'm gonna use a trim. Yeah, it is. If it's black, no one's gonna know. It's yeah, for real. And this is not air channel vinyl, so that should be fun to get all the air out. <laughs> all right, guys, we just gotta clean off the hood, make sure there's no tank on it. That way, it'll stick nicely. We're using the secret cleaner. So, uh, yeah, let's clean it. We'll throw in some music here and time lapse it. itself anywhere because this is a good Christian household and we don't approve of touching oneself. <laughs> Alright, you want to grab the backing paper brush? Yeah, just peel it off. Yeah. Lost awesome. that I shall get the corners. Alright, wait, 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 slow down. This looks like it's going to be a royal pain in the ass, dude. It's like one it. giant fucking sticker. I'm going to start lose one corner first. I feel like it will. It's just like, yeah. Uh, I don't even know. <laughs> Fuck, 
Why did I do it? This smells kind of like uh, that one inflatable chair we had. Here, Ross, can you get that corner up a little bit? Ross, that one. Sure. Hold that. Ow. You shocked me. <laughs> You stand in the front, and we're going to flip it over. Oh, I hate you. Rock on the ground, though. I got to flip around. Yes. I'm an idiot. All right. Now, keep it tight. Keep it tight. Rock, you line it up with the very edge of the hood. And hold on. we got to make sure it's centered. Hey guys, I wanted to use my nice microphone, so I paused it here to take a moment to tell you guys that the eBay auction, or eBay listing for this carbon fiber wrap said that it is pressure activated and will not stick until you put pressure on it. Easy to stretch with heat and easy to move around so you can make sure you get it where you want, strong and durable. So let's keep that in mind while we continue watching. Are you over the edge? No. Okay. I am now. Alright. How far? A lot now. Alright. There's good. Alright. How much is... It needs to go like over... It doesn't matter bro. Just make sure it goes over... About half. The edge. Don't... Don't let it stick. Don't let it stick. Oh shit. Just make sure it's over it. Okay? Okay. Alright, ready? We're gonna set it down. I need to come over more. Where? What do you mean? No way. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> okay. So. Alright. It's yeah. really hard to tell because it widens out up top. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. Just make sure it's lined up like it'll be overhanging all the way up. Okay, I will be right here. Alright. Alright. Go. Ready. Alright, just set it down. Just set it down. What about that though? We're good. Set it down. Oh, this is going to be fun. Alright. This is... No, 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 no. Leave that side down. Brock, come hold this. Oh! Strong and durable. Fantastic, dude. Just I got my finger under the corner. I think this just became a how not to wrap your hood video. <laughs> if you even want to publish it. Oh yeah, dude. people love seeing people fuck up. Anything. Just
Alright, so you guys just saw us fuck up on putting all the vinyl on the hood. Looks supreme. We're gonna stand here with the heat gun hair dryer. See if we can smooth that out a little bit, but maybe uh, this wasn't such a great idea after all. We should ask you guys what we should do with the hood. What do you guys think we should rust it out, maybe plasti dip it so it's even faker looking carbon fiber-ish? And uh, just let us know in the comment section and uh, we're gonna throw this back on the tripod and try and smooth this shit out. As if this vinyl wasn't out enough to irritate me already, it pulled our gangsta paint off the front grill. So now we're gonna have to repaint that shit. How do you feel about that? I don't know. I don't know how to feel about it. <laughs> Dude, eBay let us down. Cheap Chinese vinyl let us down. It's a shame. Alright guys, that's the end of this video and we're all pissed off now. Uh, at least we got the turbo diesel swap done. That only took a few seconds and uh, it should increase the fuel economy pretty substantially. Go ahead and leave in the comment section what you think we should do with the hood. Please don't suggest wrap it with carbon fiber vinyl. <laughs> Hit subscribe if you want to see uh, what things we can do successfully to this Honda and to the Steve of course. And uh, leave us a like, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you very much. We at least successfully carbon fibered something. Yeah, I bet it's way easier to zip now because it's so light. Oh, dude. It's, it's so... Badass, dude. So well, badass. we did something, right? Yeah. All right. <laughs> this video's car of the video goes to Robert Higgins with his Chevy S10 because I can't tell if it's cold outside or if it has a blown head gasket. Don't forget to like us on Facebook at B. Carlson Autos. Submit your pictures or videos for Car of the Video to curseforeverhelp at gmail.com. BigB1011 on Instagram. Click the bottom of the video to subscribe. And check out Robert's channel in the description. You guys have a great day.
your lead vocalist and bass player.